Hey, I'm Tim. Welcome to our onboarding series. Today, I'll walk you through the basics of setting up and using our eCard software. For this video, we're actually just going to go ahead and create a widget, add eCards to it, and then we'll show you how to send the cards and add them to your website. So let's go ahead and click a new widget. So from this page, we can give it a title that's optional. That's just for your own reference. So we'll just leave that. You can select the theme. We're just going to leave it as the great gallery for now. Let's go ahead and create our widget. Okay. So the first thing it does is it, once you save your widget, it's going to ask you to create and add your first card. The first thing we see is the templates. We've got these free templates we can select from and customize, but I'll go ahead and pick one of these. So I'm going to pick the birthday card. And then here I can actually use our, our editor to modify it. And I can also, or I could just upload like an animated GIF or a JPEG or whatever file I have on my computer if I don't want to use that. And then we've got some themes to choose from. There's the simple theme, which is just a basic, simple template. This would be delivered to your email inbox. If you're the recipient, you'd see the whole card. And with the animated experience, you would receive an email with an envelope in your inbox. You click that, it would open the page with the animated card as you see here. So we can customize this card. We can change the backdrop. So you could do, you use our free stock photos. I'm just going to find confetti, grab that. I'm going to go back. I can also change the color of the lining from gold to another color. And then I'm going to go back. And then I'm going to quickly turn on confetti. So when I open this, it's a lot more exciting with that confetti. And then I can also add audio or video just to make it more interactive and fun. Uh, you can also add content to the cards and then you've also got uh, the email subjects and you can change your customize that subject and yeah so that's pretty much it of course there's branding you can add your logo and you know social media links and change your your branding colors if you like and there's more features for you to explore or check our knowledge base on but now we've got our e-card created so we're going to go ahead and Add one more just so you can see what the gallery looks like. So we got two in here. We can see our little gallery starting to fill out. And so as in the preview, I can actually start sending these cards. So for an example, this is what you, your sender would see. Or if you want to send out a campaign, you can use this as well. So this is just a preview for you to work with. But I can also rearrange, you know, my cards, reorganize those. Um... So now that we've got our cards, we've got our widget built, we can actually go ahead and share this. We've got the share URL, so I can actually send this out to my audience. Anyone with this link can, will, will be able to access this page. This, uh, and, and here they can choose the card. They can fill out the form. They can share via other channels like Facebook or WhatsApp, or just generate a link to share here. So, but with the email, they can add their name, they can fill out this form, and then they can add the recipients and a personal message. They can preview the card and they can schedule and send it and, and whatever other options you've added. So I will show you one more thing. Here's the HTML embed code. You just copy paste that into your website and then you'll have it seamlessly embedded into your, your create a landing page, uh, put it wherever you want it. We also offer an optional WordPress plugin or Shopify plugin, but you don't need those. You can just use the embed code if you like. So I hope that helps. That's been, this has been a quick overview of getting started. And uh, if you need more detailed tutorials or that kind of thing, check out our knowledge base, check out our videos and feel free to reach out. Thanks. Thanks.